Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play SimCity 4 with me, XPUX. Uh, I'm not sure, but I think I'm going to work on Halifax in this episode. We'll take a look and see how things are going. Got to remind myself because SimCity is very slow to load for some reason. Yeah, Alright, maybe not, maybe I'm just crazy. Yes, yes, yes. So we've got a bunch of R1 and a crap load of commercial services. And a school complaining about not enough fundage, which we can handle while everything loads up and is good. I think maybe toning down the ambulance fundage. It'll help with this. Go down like that and then Oh that guy kinda has to be like that. Alright. Let's put down some high density commercial. Not too much, just enough. I'm going to leave myself some gutters here for um, some 2x4s. Uh, and if i got to put uh, jobs in there or something, I will. Yeah, I wonder what's going on with my, uh, with SimCity, the run in the background, maybe. Where are we here? Zones. Aha! That was relatively straightforward. One, two, three, four. Alright. There and there, like that. That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. That's four by fours. Gotta slow it down, baby. I got Spice Girls stuck in my head. I have no idea why. For those of you who don't know who the Spice Girls are, you are too young. Go to bed. <laughs> Alright, I'm assuming that this is going to just get gobbled up pretty quick. Um... I don't think I really have any demand for that. And just a little bit. Oh no, we have a bunch of C99. Oh, never mind. <laughs> C99 was disappeared a little bit. Oh. Oh crap. Can I go back to that? Oh man, I totally can too. That's awesome. So our, uh, what do you call that thing? place where people fly, they have airplanes, our airport upgraded. Uh, I don't know how many times you can upgrade, but once you've reached the max capacity, it'll ask you again and then do the capacity upgrade without taking up any more space. One of the reasons why I tend to use um, the little ones is they take up less land. I, you can use, sometimes you can use the tiny ones for other smaller cities. Uh, the, you do run the risk on those little ones of reaching a capacity that you can no longer expand. These guys, where are they here? I'm lagging a little bit. The small landing strips. They can be used uh, in cities where, like, I would say any if you have anything under, like, 150,000 sims, you can use them, and you should be fine. So we still got commercial growth. So let's put some zones. One, two, three, four, five. And you and you... And then uh, one, two, three, four, five. You and you, and a one, two, three, four, five. All right. Hmm. 
Buildings are in my way. One of the downsides of all these skyscrapers is that they uh, they, <laughs> they limit visibility a little bit when you uh, when you're zoning. So see how that's doing. I'm skeptical as to whether that will lead me to uh, more residential growth, but you never know. Take a look here. Medical center's still pretty fucked. This one's doing a bit better. How about our large elementary school? I think we need a high school now. Yeah, this high school does not cover. Wow, that's... Oh no, we're over overfunding it. There's a nice gigantic tower. Still, the it looks like most of these workers in the city want to work in commercial. So, uh, we can take advantage of that. For sure. Oh man, really? How big is the high school? Is it 4x4? Four four? Oh, it totally is 4x4. Four four. I'm such a genius. Alright. No. There you go. Alright. High school is like is like the key high schools are like the key to elementary schools and high schools in a lot of ways in a lot of ways elementary schools are like the key to medium wealth um, high schools help you get like good medium wealth and then a uh, good a little bit better high wealth and then obviously universities are where your when your high wealth but just starts to explode but uh, a good education is is fundamentally important as well as having access to jobs, having access to good education, good education is very important uh, for any city where you want to have more than just low wealth sims. And if you want to, I mean, scout office advantages. There's no office demand left, jerk store. All right, pause. Okay, now we're gonna put in a couple of uh, working. Methodically, we are going to put in a couple of. I don't like that. Uh, sure, why not? Sometimes to get the right zone profile, you just have to work slowly. And then sometimes. I don't want the three and the one there like that. It doesn't matter. It's not that important, to be honest. It's just annoying me. Because I like everything to look look correct. And, well, sometimes I do anyway. Alright. And we'll put in some... I'm going to try the open grass areas. Um, in the... The sim data thing that I have that from uh, GameFAQs. Those guys... the um, open grass areas are supposed to provide the most bang for your your buck kind of thing. Man, am I really low on power? Oh geez, I'm gonna need another clinic here, I bet. Yeah, of course it's this healthcare facility. Well, I don't know what to do! Tell me what to do. Yeah. Uh, right. Well, put in another another medical clinic. Try to take some of the uh, some of the pressure off of these two. All right. So where is that? Is that the high school? No. So that's got to be the elementary school, right? No. Hold on. Where, where, where did it say? Well, I'm sorry about that. Apparently there's a school there. Who knew? Alright, let's see. Uh... So we're kind of teetering. Oh no, demands are still going a little bit. Still some growth yet to happen. Some high-rise tenants and stuff. And some jobs to fill and 
new sims to do and things like that. Alright. That's pretty good like that. Some more office tower growth in our commercial area here. Over here. Just trying to let the city grow a little bit naturally. Not naturally, but... I had a thought, although I'm skeptical, I had a thought that in our little guys we could build a small... I was just thinking about this. We build a small municipal airport and, and uh, see if that would have any, any positive effects because the airports, uh, once you build them, they'll transfer regional demand. Usually, like, commercial demand and sometimes residential command, demand and stuff like that. But I'm going to hop uh, really quick. Because I've got a bunch of manufacturing demand. Oh, I'm out of water. I, I should take care of that. Because I'm going to forget. Uh, cancel. Let's go to neighbor deals. Neighbor deals. So let's draw back to there and export the garbage we know we have and I'm going to check on my uh, where are you it's not a playground I have recycling right there no? right there? no that's the stock exchange where did I put my recycling facility? there we go 16 tons eh? Hmm. Let me check the water pipes. Oh, they definitely have water. If you get black ones like this, you just destroy them and they'll regrow pretty quickly. Just like that. Sometimes they won't, even though there's a crap load of demand. That's just the way she goes. Alright. Time to do some region hopping. So this this um, city is doing really well. Uh, lots of sims and lots of jobs. Um, we have some manufacturing demand and I'm not sure what I want to do with it just yet. Just trying to look here. So no dirty tons of high wealth growth uh, in both capacities in this region, which I may have to deal with, um, I don't know. I could try putting manufacturing in Sunnyvale. I really don't want to though, because this city's really not going to be able to make any profit. Yeah, let's check a Vancouver real quick. There might be some work to do here that we could get done. i hit play and see what happens. All there is here is uh, high wealth demand anyway, so... Tax trouble, someone's closing their doors. Need a little bit of water. We are making a profit here, finally. Oh, I see what's going on. I'm gonna ship the garbage to Halifax for now. Well, this city can easily sustain a water pump. That's that's not too complicated. And put it right there and link it to the grid. Oops. No. There we go. So there's that. I think I might build a couple more neighborhoods for the, or a couple, like extend the uh, sort of the zone profile I have here out a little bit. Nothing wrong with working on high wealth. Mm, mostly I'm curious as to the uh, curious to two, one, one, two, three, four, five. Curious about the effect it'll have. Uh, zoning out this high wealth demand. Stay paused. Um, taking advantage of this high wealth demand, I'm curious as to what effect it'll have on the neighboring cities. 
Like if it'll stimulate growth or if uh, if it's irrelevant. I have a feeling like everything in SimCity it'll be important, but the truth is like I don't know what effect high wealth has. Now what just happened? Why did that happen? Oh I see what's going on here. I have a water pump. And this pump got shut off for some reason. Okay, somebody oh I understand what happened. <laughs> just connect the grid manually here all right so the first thing you need for any city is res right that worked out quite nicely and I think I'm gonna zone the residential like this That ends up with like a three slot there, and uh, I didn't notice. I thought there was a four slot there, so I'll fix that. Mm. What I'd really like is uh, two by four buildings. So, I'm gonna zone like that. And if you will see, she will be here. Alright, and so we're going to need some sort of recreational activity to bribe them in. <laughs> beach. And I'm not really sure which one to use. But, I'm going to give open grassy areas a bit of a try. It can't be all that bad. And then... Some high density commercial, no. Like that, like that. Mm, not like that. And do I have, what do I have? I got the hospital there, right? And I got the, uh, I'm at your school that nobody's using. I don't have much residential here, I don't think. Well, let's go like this. First thing, first thing is first. Connect it all up to the grid. Now, which one of you is... Neither of them are making any... Thought so. Two water pumps should be plenty of water, I think. Looks like it. Uh, go. Lots of demand, that's for sure. All right. So now I'm going to put in some high high, high density uh, or er, industrial like this. Just trying to take advantage of the uh, of what I have right now. And actually, like, high, high wealth industrial is not a bad call because we have a lot of it, for one thing. And it, uh, 
It's fairly good at... Yeah, all right, now we need some power. Is 5,000 enough? No. All right, so... I'm going to have to initiate some neighborhood deals here. Oh, I know what the pro one, of, one of the problems is here. There's no exit to the uh, my industrial city, and that's why we can't export our garbage there. So I'm going to make a connection. Just a little connection, because I don't expect there to be that much intercity traffic. There might be, but I'm skeptical. Um, but I am going to end the video there. Uh, next time, we're going to continue to work on Vancouver a little bit um, to see if we can't eliminate that high wealth demand. Um, and then we'll move on to something else. So uh, thanks for watching, and I hope you join me next time. I press F9. No. Nope.